This program is brought to you through the support of the following sponsors. A very pleasant day, friends. Welcome to another edition of Auto Review. I'm Ron de los Reyes, and today I'm coming to you from this beautiful place in San Mateo, Rizal. Yes, for a change, we go to uh, different places just to uh, test drive the capability of our test unit. And this time, we have the 2022 Honda HRV Turbo, 1.5 liter gasoline engine. And uh, of course, we've passed through various uh, terrains going up to Antipolo and then here in uh, Tanay Rizal. We did a little bit of off-road. Uh, this car is, is capable indeed. And for a change, we're bringing uh, our test drives to some campsites or possible campsites like this one in San Mateo Rizal. We'll tell you more about the Honda HRB later on in the show. In the meantime, let's take a look at the latest in motoring on our Auto News Update. Toyota Motor Philippines kicked off the new year with the announcement of some special offers. These offers include the Pay Low, Pay Light, or Cash Savings promos. These deals are available for the Toyota Vios, Wigo, Altis, Avanza, Raze, Rush, Innova, Fortuner, Hilux, Light Ace, High Ace, and Velos. These models come with free periodic maintenance of up to 20,000 kilometers, while the Light Ace gets an exclusive fixed PMS package at 1,999 pesos per service until its 40,000 kilometer maintenance check. In addition, customers can also avail of trade in rebates for those who want to upgrade their Toyota. Free one-year comprehensive insurance is also available for some models, while selected variants of the Vios get a free five-year warranty. The promo runs until January 31, 2023. Isuzu Philippines Corporation launched its solar photovoltaic project with the goal of becoming energy self-sufficient and reduce carbon dioxide emissions in its manufacturing plant in Binyan, Laguna. As Isuzu gears toward being a more sustainable automotive chain, this drives the company through an ESG perspective, environment, social and governance. And as part of its effort in becoming an energy self-sufficient company, IPC installed 1,100 solar PV panels on the roof of its manufacturing plant in late 2022. Currently, with its 500 kilowatt capacity, the solar PV panels have been successfully supplying up to 22% of the energy consumption of the IPC manufacturing plant. Now former IPC President Noboru Murakami said, With the launch of our solar PV project, we are taking a big step towards leading the industry on the road to sustainability. Mr. Murakami kicked off the Road to Progress vision in May 2022. Prior to transferring to his new designation this January 2023, he, together with IPC VP for Manufacturing, Yoshiki Yanai, was able to oversee the progress and the successful launch of the IPC Solar PV project.
Welcome back to Auto Review. There are so many things to like about the Honda HRV. First and foremost is the Honda Sensing technology. I also like the space, which is comfortable uh, for at least five persons. And also the space at the back, which is ideal for bringing stuff for camping and for long travels. Even in the past, uh, I like the first generation Honda HRV because of its compact uh, design and uh, spacious space and of course its maneuverability, especially during a congested uh, traffic condition. But now you have a much improved HRV. Of course, you see this uh, beautiful grill and uh, the Honda icon, and it has uh, daylight uh, running lights and also powerful uh, headlamps. Uh, and uh, you also have uh, some skirt uh, below the bumper, and it adds to the sporty look of uh, the HRV. And over here, you, you have the uh, turn signals and also for the hazards. And uh, the side mirrors of this vehicle automatically retract or open when you use your uh, remote key. And even if you don't use your remote key, all you have to do is uh, go away from the vehicle and it will just retract. Look at this. Kahit yung kambing, ha? Na appreciate yung on the HRV. Wow, I like this place. Huh? We just discovered it and uh, there are a lot of uh, goats over here just uh, feeding on on the grass and it's relatively quiet but you hear the chirping of the birds and at night I can imagine you can hear a lot of uh, those uh, natural sounds coming from uh, the insects and, and the birds. Okay, let's continue with our walk around. <laughs> walk around because it's my name, Ron De Los Reyes. Ito po sa Auto Review. Uh, you have this uh, beautiful wheels and uh, it has a higher ground clearance than the previous model of uh, the uh, HRV. I'm reminded of the new uh, BRV, which also has uh, this lining, very straight and black on the perimeter, and it goes all the way to the bumper. So this is a turbo uh, variant of uh, the HRB. Opening this is uh, easy. You see some uh, camping stuff uh, right here. And uh, this uh, vehicle is also flexible. It has a, a flexible seating arrangement. Uh, of course, you can uh, fold down the, the rear seats and create more space for your cargo or uh, for your uh, baggage. You have these uh, LED lights to help you see what you put in or what you put out. In the past, uh, I think sometime last June, we had a group uh, test drive of the HRB uh, in Tagaytay and also in Anilao, uh, Batangas. But, uh, uh, this is a little bit of a different experience because uh, we get to take home the HRB and uh, drive it for at least a week. Yeah. Alright, this uh, SUV has a roomy interior, of course, uh, for the driver. I have a lot of uh, headroom. You see here uh, the controls for the audio entertainment system and also for cruise control, which is very useful whenever you go on a long drive and if you're using the highway. So it's a push button start and uh, you have uh, outlets here for your USB uh, charging. And then you have uh, uh, this nice, uh, shift stick uh, for the automatic transmission and also under the steering wheel uh, you can go 
on a sporty mode and uh, use these paddle shifters. And you have space here for your cups. All right, this is where I put my <laughs> RFIDs and also reading glass right here. More storage here and uh, armrest and controls for the windows and also for the central door locks. Although when you're on the move already, well, the doors are automatically locked. You have uh, map lights uh, right here, the, the visors, and also you have the vanity mirror, which is lit. Even here, you have a lighted uh, vanity mirror. Air conditioning is good. You have uh, uh, four vents in front, and also uh, another big vent at the rear uh, for the convenience of uh, your passengers at the back. You have a leather uh, seat which hugs you at the back so you don't get tired easily even when you drive to longer uh, distances. So I've been driving this for a couple of days and uh, I like it because even if I go to let's say on the NLEX and also drive through some traffic I don't get easily tired. It also has an uh, electronic brake uh, system so you don't have that uh, pull up uh, handbrake all you have to do is uh, take a look at this so when the, the light here is, is on it means that the brakes are locked and uh, to unlock you just have to press it down like that so I put it on lock first and then I go to the rear. Alright, this is something that is a little bit unique to the Honda HRV. You think it's only a two-door uh, vehicle, but actually it's a four-door. And uh, you don't notice this right away unless you have uh, gone to uh, a uh, showroom and uh, the sales rep uh, showed you how to open the rear. It doesn't have a handle over here but it's up here and it gives that uh, sporty feeling like a two-door uh, crossover but here it's very easy to open although personally I still like the conventional <laughs> but this is quite unique for the HRV. Very few vehicles have uh, this uh, type of uh, opening for the for the rear wow there's a lot of space here at the back uh, as i said there's vent right here and then you also have uh, two usb uh, outlets very relaxing here at the back especially when you put down this wide of, of an armrest and you have provision for two cups or for two bottles of uh, water so when you go on a long drive and you have a driver the more you are relaxed you have seat belts uh, for three passengers and for the one in the middle you will have a lap belt legroom no problem because uh, that was my position when i was the driver and here that i'm passenger i, I have maybe a foot of uh, knee room as I said, this has a flexible uh, seating arrangement, like if you need more space for the luggage. This actually folds flat. I haven't tried if I can uh, lie down here. I think uh, this will also be uh, comfortable for uh, uh, persons who would like to take a rest and take a nap uh, at the back. In fact, I have here a folding mattress, which I can try later on. See if it's comfortable. Wow, quite relaxing. It's also good for the back. Parang may tubunog dun sa likod ko eh. <laughs> Parang ka na rin nagpamassage. But of course, uh, you would still prefer to sleep in a tent. But just in case the weather is not cooperating, then you can sleep inside your car. Ito yung maganda eh, pagka yung sasakyan mo, uh, very versatile. Pwede mong dalhin kahit saan. 
pag inabot ka ng antok or pagod, pwede kang mag-relax katulad ng gantong position. Okay, we open the baggage space and uh, there's this cover and you have a uh, also a 17-inch tire but uh, actually it's the donut type. Uh, you have a narrower uh, width so you save a lot of space. And uh, over here you have the tonneau cover. Very light. It's very light but uh, it's good to, to block the sun from the outside. Here's our car price watch for the Honda HRV. And if you enjoyed uh, watching or listening to us uh, doing this walk around of the Honda HRV, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is Auto Review. Philippines and also please tell your friends about it. We see each other every Saturday on TV 2.30 to 3 p.m. on People's Television Channel 4 and also on Facebook and YouTube and uh, Marami Salamat po. I would appreciate uh, your also sharing this with your friends and members of the family. Auto Review will be back. Stay with us. We've been with BPI for many years. Buta na lang, like before. Mm. <laughs> Nasunog din din pagkain. <laughs> Thankfully, may BPI QR code pang order. Life saver yun ah. Mm -hmm. But mm. the best pa rin talaga mm -hmm. is when we got our BPI home loan. That's why BPI helps us love the life we live today and tomorrow. Back to Auto Review. On our What's New, we have the first vehicle launch for 2023, and this is the new Ertiga Hybrid. Uh, well, Suzuki Philippines uh, gave us a preview of the Ertiga Hybrid uh, back in September of uh, 2022 when they showed it at the Philippine International Motor Show or the PIMS. Now we see it in four variants. And uh, this is the hybrid Ertiga, and it promises to have a better fuel economy and a better distance for your journey, and uh, of course, a comfortable ride. And uh, later on, we will talk to the uh, general manager for automobile of Suzuki Philippines, Mr. Norahide Take, 
And what's surprising about this new Ertiga is that the price hasn't really moved up. There's only a slight, very slight increase in the prices. So they also have uh, the manual transmission model, which is priced below 1 million pesos. And it's a seven-seater. Looking forward to test drive one. Ertiga Hybrid is equipped with uh, lightweight and uh, compact self-charging uh, hybrid technology that saves while dynamic response uh, with uh, improved the home uh, and advanced function and safety features. The new Ertiga Hybrid is upgraded light for the Filipinos. When uh, we joined the uh, teams, uh, uh, many customers uh, have had a good impression <laughs> for uh, Ertiga hybrid <laughs> model. Uh, so uh, we decided to introduce uh, this model. We're introducing a new concept for Suzuki Philippines as far as hybrid vehicles is concerned. Well, there is a clamor already in the market for this simply because the worsening traffic plus high fuel cost, there is really a need for a fuel efficient rather than a conventional engine. So that's why Suzuki responded to the clamor of the market plus a more environmental friendly vehicle. So we launched this uh, for everyone and for every consumer out there. We try really to give the market a, a very good alternative as far as performance is concerned, environment friend, uh, friendly concern, plus we make it a point that uh, the vehicles that Suzuki gives to the market and offers to the market is affordable and will not somehow give them more burden. Now we want them not to experience the excitement of the drive but not painful to the pocket as we say. regular battery sir so what's special about this is about the smart hybrid uh, technology of Suzuki so on, on the back of this engine would be the ISG we call the integrated starter generator that converts the kinetic energy during deceleration of this car transform it into electrical energy and store it on the lithium-ion battery just under the driver's seat then that same energy is being used by the ISG to act as an electric motor to provide support during takeoff and acceleration of the vehicle. So that's creating better fuel consumption and good uh, driving dynamics. During deceleration, it's not only the lithium ion that's being charged, but also, also this the, the lead acid battery as well, sir. And that's our show for today. I hope you enjoyed it. And we would like to thank Honda Cars Philippines for providing us our test vehicle this week. This is the 2022 edition of the Honda HRV. It's a very capable uh, crossover. And uh, in fact, we came all the way from uh, Quezon City to this part of San Mateo in Rizal. Until next week, at the same time here on Auto Review, this is Ron De Los Reyes saying thank you for joining us. Drive safely all the time. We'll see you next week. Maraming salamat po.